welcome to medieval to total war. But we're Muslim. Muslim Vikings. Here we go. This is going to be fun. Uh, so yeah, let's uh, check out the current situation in Aarhus right now. Uh, King Knud, what have you done? Uh, of course, 15%. This, this is going to take a bit of work, but overall the people are, you know, they're not too unhappy about it, like, only 60%. Like, that's not actually too bad, with, the, the overall population is very happy with the current situation. Alright, but anyway, we have to do some conversion, so let's build this. How much is this going to help? 2%. And we have an imam here as well. Oh, he's a bishop. <laughs> yeah, the traits are not exactly updated. Um, a great imam, though. Five piety at the start. Ooh. Right, bring the port. Right, bring the boats into the docks. Seriously, their natural number is 37 in a squad? Why? Why does it have to be an odd number like, oh god. Not only an odd number, but a prime number. Why? I just put it up to 40. Oh, whatever, whatever. Right. Ah, uh, this Viking merchant here. Uh, get him, I think, to the silver. Yeah, yeah, he can go this way. Um, our Viking spy, he can go down to the HRV. Alright, I believe this squad here needs a general, and with that they can take Norway. Meanwhile, this army here does need some mercs and put Hamburg under siege. Oh, we can get some more as well. You know what? I will get them. Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, we can get the settlement on very high tax, uh, which is very good. Right, so what can we get? Long boats and... <laughs> Why? Why is it like this? I don't know. Let's recruit two town militia units, and we could actually do with a diplomat, really. Yeah, we don't get any option for the Pope. Uh, yeah, let's get a diplomat instead. Uh, get one of them coming, and I want the... The two archers to go down. Yeah, that should be fine. Meanwhile, the Imam can stay here, just uh, convert Denmark over a little bit. Alright, one turn in. We got it to 20%. That is quite the jump. Uh, I don't think we need... If we're going up 5% per turn, do we really need to upgrade it? Go for some farms, I think. Okay then, at Hamburg right now, up to the walls we go. Ready, General? It doesn't look that Islamic, does he? I guess, yeah, I guess they haven't had time to change the uniforms yet. Uh, their archers are firing, we should be fine though. Uh, we can move our missiles up now. They should get a few shots in up there, help out a little bit. We've got the ram coming over on this side as well. I might actually get the General round here. We might be able to uh, charge in and catch some off guard whilst on the street. Possibly. The ladders have arrived. Uh, bring forwards for reinforcing infantry. Yeah, they should be fine to buy that point. Alright, is everyone firing now? Yep, does look like it. They should get a few extra kills, possibly. Yeah, a few extra kills up here on the walls. Good, we're gonna hit the missile units first. Maybe don't fire at this point. I'm worried about friendly fire. Maybe have a go at them. Fire at them, but nobody else. Ah, we're getting kills in over on this side. Nah, it's not looking good. Ah, oh, we got one. The tower's at the wall. Alright, well, they're moving anyway, so... Yeah, best stop firing. Yeah, don't fire at will as well. Just stop altogether. We've got to take the walls by force. Uh, we're, doing an, we're doing an okay job here. Good, the ram has now reached... The tower's getting up here. Good, we broke them. Right, you've battled there. That was a very good break. They're still activating the towers though. And come on, we need these up here quick. And we need the general round as well. Alright, good, it's open. Right, charging the general. Charging the spears as well at some point. Um, is everyone up on the walls yet? Right, you can move in now. They're up here. Right, you flank them. 
General, get round here. Spearman reinforcements, you get up onto... Yeah, yeah, they'll find something to do. Right, come on, General, you hit the archers. And block off their retreat path as well. Have they hit them in the back yet? Come on, Spearman. Get a move on. There we go, and now this should be the win. Right here. Well, not the win, but close enough. Come on, General. It might be registering them as being on the wall. Right, there we go. We got them, break them, charge them down. Ah, oh, he's been very unresponsive right now. So are these as well. Okay, that's all their missiles gone. Uh, time to get our own archers up onto the walls. This is so satisfying to watch. <laughs> it's amazing how satisfying it actually is. All taking their time, going... Yeah, going only when it's their turn to go. It's beautiful. Alright, that squad is now almost done. There we go. And then this one's falling apart quicker. Oh, wow. Oh, they've stopped. That kind of ruined it there at the end. Oh, massive traffic jam. Oh, God, what's going on? There's spearmen in here as well. Oh, no. <laughs> Come on, figure it out. Should have just taken the ladders, shouldn't we? Yeah, why do I always go for these siege towers? Should always go ladders. <laughs> Alright, sadly they are a little bit all stuck at this point, but I think we should be fine. We don't really need everybody up here. Let's just take them out. This is my favourite bit. Getting all the archers, the crossbows, onto the wall. There's nothing they can really do about it. They can charge, but that's about it. How close to their own walls can they get? Can't imagine they'll get very close. Yeah, look at that. They might actually activate that tower. That could be annoying. But no, they've stopped. No tower activated. And now they're just getting slaughtered. Yeah, there's nothing they can really do. And then they flee. You know what? Change of plan. Let's burn them alive. <laughs> Here we go. The fire arrows coming in. Let's burn them. Hey, we did it. Well done, soldiers. Well done. You know me at this point. I only see one option available. <laughs> Alright, but what do we do here then? Because, yeah, 0% currently. Uh, which means we do have to build that. Yeah, get that built. I think the Imam would be better off in Hamburg. Possibly. Ah, right, let's see if the Holy Roman Empire is wanting an alliance. It does look like it. I'll give you maps as well, if you give me a bit of gold. Running short on gold right now. Would he accept that? I think he would. Yeah, just. Okay, and now go round to France. Meanwhile, he can head towards the Poles. Uh, we've got another Imam down here for Hamburg. 10% already and 28% up here. Uh, that's looking very good. Alright, so yeah, we got all the Muslim buildings, don't we? Uh, town Guard, uh... Sushi bar. Do we upgrade a temple? I think we could do with doing that. <laughs> we still get Norse war clerics though. <laughs> uh, you know what? Let's get a port in Hamburg in the queue. I think that could be the better option. Ooh, uh, Oslo's a little bit more defended than I thought it would be. We might not be able to win that. Maybe try to starve it out. No mercenaries. Hmm, I, I'm, I'm regretting my decision a bit. Yeah, we might be able to get some spearmen up. Seriously, he... Oh, no. We cannot beat this guy. Nothing we can do about him. Oh, that's so annoying. Oh, we can't even afford a new one as well. Alright, I think there's only one thing for it then. Uh, we'll have to put him there. Yeah, we've got to, we got to defeat him now by other means. We've got no other choice. Oh, he was once such a loyal imam to the Vikings, but now he's got to go. There we go. We got rid of him. <laughs> I love how they all turn onto it. <laughs> all right, I got reinforcements up here. We should be able to take Oslo uh, when they do finally attack, but I don't think we can win it as a siege. Uh, we could get him. Another general. Do we need him? I don't think we do. Maybe go for just map information and trade. And maybe get a bit of money out of it. I'd be fine with this, come on. 
I feed when he's shot. I'll take what I can get. And then same again with the poles. How much money can we get here? Possibly about a thousand. Oh no, that's not a good sign. <laughs> they lost at Magdeburg, but we couldn't get any money out of them. I'll give it one more go. Where did they go to? Oh, I've lost them now. Oh, we got no money. We can't even pay for the imam to convert the province over. <laughs> oh, this is not looking good. Alright, I lost the poles. We'll have to go for one of their settlements instead. Alright, the rebels at Oslo are attacking. I think we can beat them here, possibly, hopefully. Uh, they have missile advantage, possibly in infantry advantage. I don't know, but we have a cavalry unit. Let's give it a go. Can we win it? Sadly, the AI had to choose a foggy battle. It must know how much I hate these. Alright, oh, they're already here. Alright, archers firing good. Uh, cavalry, you distract them. Alright, they're having... Yeah, most of their troops are actually going for my cavalry, which is... Uh, very good. Very good, I'll definitely take this. Uh, okay, so, you charge them. Missile units, you fire at them. Yeah, well done, cavalry. Distract them all. Uh, you've got to hit there. You go this way. Right, you hit them. I don't know what the archers can fire at. They've got, a, they've got an okay shot there. Right, you charge them in the back. Can our infantry actually win this? I don't know. I'm unsure if our infantry can beat their axemen. Come on, they're charging in. And then maybe go for the missiles after this charge. But I think we need to uh, defeat this squad here. Ah, uh, they didn't break. It wasn't a that good charge. Ah, uh, their crossbows are firing. Can we hold out over here? We're both... Us and the enemy are shaken. Right, good. They're fleeing. Is that enemy general dead? Okay, now we can win it. There we go. They broke. You charge them. You go there. You continue shooting them. Cavalry should break the archers. Why does it sound like a UFO just landed outside? I don't know. <laughs> And maybe a quick charge on those crossbows, and that should be the win. Quite an easy win, I'm happy with that. Run them all down, don't let them get back. Come on, this should be it here. Oh, did one return? Yeah, they're starting to return to the field. That's not good. But the general should be able to deal with it. Oh, he's struggling, pull him out. There we go, we got it. Whew. And, you know, I only see one option available. Uh, so, yeah, exterminate the population. All right, come on, give me a bit of money. I don't want much. Just 600. Yes, good. Right, now go to Venice. I was about to say, no one's uh, married her yet, which I find to be very odd, but then I just remembered. We're an Islamic faction. We're not meant to have princesses, are we? I don't know how this is going to work. She, then, to us is just a normal diplomat, isn't she? Yeah, she's just a diplomat. Ah, that's... never thought about that. <laughs> well, well we, we have an offer, and for chivalry is actually quite good. What do I want? Trade with Venice or for chivalry? I'm actually going to take for chivalry. Yeah, alright, he's all the way up in Oslo. We'll, we can send a boat up there to get him. Yeah, put him in the capital. Convert that... well, not convert it over, but... Just to boost the population. That would be an extra 2.5% for free. So yeah, but it still does work. Okay, Poland. Come on, give me some money. Something, please. Oh, they are bankrupt though. I doubt we'll get much out of them. Maybe ask for 500. Right, we got something. Alright, now go down to the Hungarians. Hopefully money can start ticking up now. Is that going to be enough? Alright, the Poles took Magdeburg. Uh, we failed that settlement, uh, that mission, but that's okay. Oh, I don't like the looks of those fleets. Right, we've got to get him on quick and sail away. Alright, they're right there, right. Dock him over. Uh, can we win this? Yes, heroic victory, only just. Right, sail round. I bet the other fleet will destroy us, though. I've got a plan for this fleet, that's why I'm... Trying to keep it, you know, at a reasonable size and alive. Yeah, he's a massive help there. Currently, our house is at 50%. 43% in Hamburg and uh, still 0% over here. Trying to convert it over into a settlement. Hopefully we can get that done soon. 
Oh, he pushed me off the tile and now I can't see Magdeburg. Stupid merchant. Hey, let's see how you like it. Oh, no, I can only investigate him. Right, that spot's okay. Finally, we're in positive money. Finally, at last. All right, we got another imam coming. Good. Finally, we got there. All right, bit of money from Hungary and some trade. Right, now go to the Venetians. Then do we go to the Pope? I think we do. Oh, he's not gaining any piety, is he? Ah, they're both on one. That's annoying. Alright, good. Get the mosque built in Oslo and increase the tax there. That should be a lot more money coming in now. And we should start converting Oslo over. A large city ready for upgrade. We should get there soon. Yeah, we'll get there eventually. Crusade called for Cairo. Thankfully, it's not us. <laughs> I think that could be possible. Uh, okay, so... Alliance with the Pope. Come on, let's get this. I want a bit of gold as well. Right, I want it to be generous because I want him to accept. There we go. Right, now go over to Byzantium. We got an alliance with the Pope. We got there. All right, there's a heretic here. Level three. All right, this guy here is a level four. Can he do it? 41% chance. Nah. Ah, oh, well. Uh, maybe this guy? We got him. Good. Good. And he, he got an upgrade as well. You know what? This guy then? Let's give him a special treat. Declare the Jihad for London. It's being called. Here we go. Alright, so step the army outside. Uh, let them join. Right, good. That sends us to war with the English for. Uh, we don't have to get some mercenaries. How are we looking financially? Uh, cut back a little bit. Alright, these two Imams, uh, yeah, get them all a little bit more down here. Jihad grows. Denmark has joined. <laughs> Alright, so what mercenaries can we get? Yeah, get two of them, two of them. I'll, I'll take the army, because of course this is an army we're not paying for anymore, so yeah, we're making a lot of money. Basically, all of our troops are here. And we have an alliance with Poland and the HRE, so, you know, I doubt they're going to attack us. Uh, you know, I'm sure the Medieval 2 AI will hold to their alliance. Hopefully. <laughs> they're not going to have it. Oh, is the stupid rebel actually going to block me? Stupid Harry. I hate Harrys. Alright, good, he moved away. I'm piling them all up in Hamburg. I have a little plan. I don't know if it would work for... Yeah, like, look at this. Every settlement now, almost, is producing buildings. We've got gold spare. We're in a good p position financially now. But once this crusade is over, it might get a little bit trickier. Oh, look, we can reach it already. Right, yes. Um, Get round this way. Oh, we're one tile away from the bridge. Right, the boats, they're going to get sunk anyway, aren't they? Try and pull back. All right, then, put London under siege. There we go. Oh, just go ladders, I think. Uh, I think I might actually be starving it out, though. It's only six turns, and I don't want to fight this on the walls. Yeah, we don't really have that aggressive units. We're better in a defensive position, so... Yeah, starve them out. All right, so Aarhus is at 79% Islamic, 82% at Hamburg, and only 27% up there, but that's... That's okay. Oslo is not too important. Right, what I want to do is, can we convert Frankfurt over to Islam? Let, let's give it a go, put all the Imams in here, let's see what happens, can we do it? Well, it's already at 6%, so we are beating them so far. Oh, oh, they didn't attack at all. Now that's interesting, okay. Oh, they didn't attack at all, I definitely made the right call then. Uh, thieves guild now. Ah, oh, good. Jihad complete. It was a success. 798 florins and the army gains experience. There we go. But yeah, now we have the problem of having to convert it over. Uh, so let's at least try and make a start on that. But we're making a lot of gold now that we've got London. That's a lot of money coming through. So much money. I've just put, uh, well, I did it a couple of turns ago, put these on low tax to just boost the population. 
We don't need the extra money right now. Uh, meanwhile, we're at 20% Islam over here. That's good. Upgrading the churches in our own land. That's good too. Huh, weird. Naval Underscore Academy. No capital letters. Huh. Alright, so I believe we can now get, yes, Norse War Clerics. Uh, because we built the correct uh, tier of religious building. Uh, got another Imam being trained in Hamburg. Yep, he can go down to Frankfurt. I did see a rebel army just spawn outside Frankfurt and attack the city, so... I think they are actually having some issues right now. Uh, I might get my spy in there to uh, check it out. Alright, sadly he died. Uh, but what information could we get? So it's 48% Islamic right now. Uh, we cannot see the public order there. Not yet. Uh, England want a ceasefire. Uh, but the one Nottingham and London. I will give them a ceasefire, trade rights and my maps for their maps. I'm happy to accept that. We don't need the money. Uh, I'd rather just have a bit of peace and spend some time uh, converting it all over again. Oh, faction leader King Canud has died. Alright, Hamburg is at 91%. Where can we get it with one turn with five imams? Uh, some of them low ranking, but some, you know, at tier 5. Uh, it, it went down. It's now at 90%. Oh, no. We had a heretic. Oh, well, who is our best? I think it's this guy. Yeah, get rid of him. There we go. Do we gain experience as well? Come on, hopefully we did. Yeah, we got plus 2, God. Let's recruit another. Alright, now it's going up again. I don't think we'll get it to 100% though. That could uh, take a while. And funnily enough, it seems England might be the successful Crusader faction. <laughs> they're not in a good spot, England, but at least they're having their own fun down there in Africa. And they took it. Well done, England. We're at 97%. I just want to see it reach 100%. Yeah, it's starting to really slow down now, 97%. Yeah, just move them, move them into Frankfurt for one more final turn. Ah, can we clear out the heretic for them? There we go, we got him. How much piety did we gain from that? Plus two again? No, just plus one. Uh, really? We get the, the option to build uh, Templar, <laughs> Knights Templar places? <laughs> yeah, that's interesting. Yeah, we, we can convert them over. How does that look then? Yeah, we can get Knights Templar. <laughs> uh, anyway, don't take this mod too seriously at all. It was just a little laugh, a bit of fun, uh, seeing how it would work, what would happen if the Vikings just decided in 1080 to go Muslim. And yeah, this is what happened. It's actually very normal, a very normal campaign. It doesn't feel like that weirdly different now being able to jihad on london that was the uh, that did uh, definitely change up the campaign a bit but apart from that you know it's not it's not too different like you gotta do a bit more conversion but that's about it you know i could have easily taken these two rebel settlements before factions got their hands on them if i was really going for that but no my plan was always to take london so yeah, hope you enjoyed. Uh, this idea was inspired by a YouTuber called To Nerd Is To Human, who also covers some Rome Total War content um, every now and then. Uh, he did something very similar, uh, but for the Holy Roman Empire. His is more of an actual full let's play, like a serious let's play with multiple episodes. And he also did a guide on how you can mod this. I did use that guide to be able to create this mod for myself and try it out. So yeah, if you want to check him out, uh, certainly do. He has some, some interesting videos and he was of course the inspiration behind uh, this little video here. Which I hope you enjoyed. If you did, please do subscribe, share, maybe even leave a like as well. But anyway, for now, I have been Melkor, and I do hope you enjoyed today's video. For now, until the next one, goodbye.